Hey y'all, Salt Intuition Tarot. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are in the universe. Collective check-in. Now let's see what's going on. Remember to like, share, comment. Well, subscribe, hit the like button, notification bell, so you'll be notified for future readings. Let's see what's going on for the collective check-in. We have the Hierophant in reverse. We also have the Six of Cups in reverse. Somebody is definitely letting go of the past, growing up, trying to mature. Uh, someone in the past was not conforming. It didn't matter what rules or boundaries you put up. This person just would not listen. Well, everything's going to be turning around. This could involve a Taurus. Someone a Taurus or a Scorpio is dealing with. All right, we have the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. There's going to be some type of unexpected change coming in for the collective. Something that was routine, something you did daily, there's going to be something unexpectedly happening that is going to change your routine up. You could be moving, having to move, having to move on, abandoning a plan, letting go, traveling. Um, someone's reached the limit. They're um, having a lot of self-analysis, you know, discovering, looking in deeper into something, withdrawing, um, looking for the truth, being able to move on, get out of this routine that they've had their life in. You also have the King of Pentacles in reverse. Someone definitely feels like they mismanaged their money, time, attention. Um, someone that used to be a gold digger is changing their ways. Yes, that's exactly what the cards say. Yes, that is what it's saying. They're walking away and abandoning that long overdue routine Using people for clout or using people for money, this person is actually going to change their damn ways. Comment down below. Let me know if this resonates. All right, moving on. Someone that's made an investment feels like it is was a bad investment. They're going to try to um, escape this investment so for some of y'all that have made investment stocks bonds something like that this is financial part of this reading um you're you're going to release that you feel like whatever you put your time and attention to um is not growing as you feel it should and then you're going to release that okay we have the page of cups are universe and judgment there's someone that's had some type of uh Childhood issues, there could have been some type of bad news, some type of sexual abuse. I hate to throw that in there. It's what the cards are saying. Um, is now, you know, trying to get some type of forgiveness. Want some, somebody that has done something terrible to you in the past when you were growing up wants your forgiveness. That's what I see. Yes, somebody from the past wants your forgiveness. They're very unhappy. They feel like they have really messed your life up, their life up. And uh, there could some, you know, childhood issues, some kind of abuse that happened. And they're wanting, they're wanting you to forgive them. Okay, we have the lovers in reverse. Also, temperance in reverse, so there's definitely a Gemini. This could deal with a Gemini, Sagittarius. And we have the Seven of Cups. It, you know, somebody is off balance. There's a lot of trust issues. Someone you've had trust issues with or feels like they're detaching themselves from you. It looks like the procrastination that they've been giving you. You're going to fit, find out why. Why is why is the procrastination here? Why were they procrastinating? Why were they giving you the runaround? Why were they not coming out with the truth? 
They felt burdened and they... <laughs> they felt burdened and they felt like they had to sacrifice themselves too much. Somebody feels like they're sacrificing themselves too much for a situation. And they no longer want to feel burdened anymore. And you are at the Ten of Wands. And it looks like somebody's going to be dropping it like it's hot. They're going to be dropping a Gemini. And it's going to involve a Gemini, a Cancer. Definitely here. And a Sagittarius. Somebody's getting ready to drop a burden. A person, place, or thing. They're just tired of the situation. What else? What else do we need to know? And we have the world in reverse. Somebody, uh, as they're going to be disappointed because they have not achieved their goals. Someone took a leap of faith. Uh, too soon, in love. Knight of Cups. Full card. Uh, someone felt like they could be optimistic. It was the right time. But the Five of Swords in reverse says... It is the right time to end a conflict if that's what you were trying to do. But when it comes to leap of faith in a love offer, end the conflict, forget the love part of the situation. And that's what I have for you for today. Y'all like, share, comment as well, subscribe, and appreciate y'all being here. Y'all have a good one.